Hello friends and welcome to my channel FNB classes. In today's video, we are going to learn how to use the service gear while serving the food in the restaurant. As we all know that the service gear is a combination of two pieces of flatware that is the spoon and the fork. We need a uh, service fork and a service spoon and the combination is known as the service gear and we use this combination to serve almost all the preparations in the restaurant whether they are the main course preparations or the rice preparations or something with curry or gravy or maybe some fried or grilled or roasted almost everything so we should know very well how to hold this and how to use this and how to manipulate the service gear if required at times let's see how to do this Now first, we'll hold the spoon at the bottom and fork at the top. This way, like this, right? And whenever we are holding the service spoon and the service fork, it should be locked somewhere here, like this. If it is not locked properly, you will not be able to move it this way conveniently. So we'll again check the position of the fingers and the entire hand how we are holding it both the ends are being locked here like you can see this way both should be locked here three fingers beneath the service gear thumb on top index finger in between the spoon and the fork now the index finger and the thumb will guide this entire system to be manipulated like this so this is the hand position wherein we are holding the service gear, the service spoon and the service fork. Now we'll see how to use this. For example, if we are if we are about to serve a rice preparation, now there is no point of you know holding the spoon and the fork like this. And we can use, we can manipulate this service gear like this. Now the service gear is in this position now what happens in this position is now the service uh, gear is having the more surface area that way we can conveniently serve the rice preparations from the entree dish or from a rice platter this way right from a platter or entree rice is being served like now we we have you know, now we are having more of the surface area with this service gear we can serve rice nicely properly and conveniently also now you can see in this position all the four fingers are beneath the service gear and only thumb is there on the top and i'm holding it conveniently and serving the rice from the entree or from the rice platter to the guest plate okay Next is if, if we are serving something with some curry or gravy. Now uh, in that case, we won't be requiring the fork. If there's something uh, liquid, curry, gravy, the fork is not required. So in that case, what we can do is we can again take it back little much under the spoon and we can use only the spoon to take out the curry or the gravy. And this way we can serve the curry or the gravy in the guest plate simply using the spoon only right for rice we can have this little extended to get the more surface area for curries and gravies we can push it little inside right this way and we can use only the spoon to serve the curry and the gravy now otherwise whatever is being served from the entree uh, i'll show you right we use we hold it like this if it is a dry vegetable or some piece of steak or grilled fish we can take this pick this you know hold it little firmer so that it doesn't uh, slip off and then taking uh, this uh, entree or the uh, platter onto the guest plate and we can serve that thing this right picking holding little firmly little firmly not uh, with too much pressure or strength just uh, with little pressure 
and then releasing and if there is something stuck uh, in the spoon also then we can do a quick this thing right we can do a quick this thing so that whatever is there in the spoon gets slipped off onto the plate so this way we can serve anything any food article dish preparation with some curry or the gravy or any other thing now with the service gear there's one more manipulation which we can do but then this uh, we can do uh, while, when we are serving a preparation or a dish having a rounded size it may be uh, some entree with uh, small meat joints it may be some uh, other preparation for example the indian preparation there are uh, so many indian pre uh, preparations wherein we have uh, some rounded objects in the preparation for example the dam aloo the malai kofta and even there are a lot of desserts like gulab jamun now in those cases what we can do is to hold that rounded object or the piece of meat or the kofta or the dam aloo conveniently we can do this thing we can turn the fork upside down we can turn the fork upside down and this way we are in a better position to hold that rounded object whether it is a piece of meat right or any other thing so you can do this thing you can hold it right hold pick up hold and release pick hold release right so this is how we can manipulate the service gear you know depending upon the dish to be served into the guest plate whether it is a rice we can use the service gear in a different manner if, if there's something with the curry or gravy we can use the service gear a little differently if there's something with the, some rounded object we can use the service gear a little differently so it is all about the convenience so you should know how to manipulate the service gear within your fingers and the hand and if you know the skill you will be able to serve the guest more conveniently and more efficiently and you will be able to provide a service delight to the guest that's all for today friends if you like the content and the information in the video please do like and subscribe and also hit the bell icon for the future notifications of my upcoming videos thank you